Guys, it's the 9th of June. We're over in York, just a few days off, and uh, we're going over to Nesborough this morning. So I might take a few shots just to show you. I'll spin you around. We're just in a little park at the moment, just down from um, the railway station. Blue sky. We're having really good weather. We feel very lucky. And uh, the river's just over there. Yeah. Right, well, hopefully, we'll catch you in Nursborough. Here we go. There's the market day. The remains of Nesborough Castle. The uh, walls left actually. I think a lot of it was damaged in the Civil War, the English Civil War. It's all the uh, open space. There's something about medieval stonework that uh, never fails to impress me. The skill of the medieval masons is brilliant. Yeah, some fabulous. The railway line goes over the river there. Then you can hire boats. And if you can just make them out, just down the bottom, just down there. So there's a quite a steep uh, winding pathway that goes right down to the river. So we'll have a walk down. And it's fine. Which is called the shot of the viaduct, quite an imposing structure. Something I've not actually seen before on my visits to Nesborough is this house with a thatched roof. Pretty rare for this part of the world, I would think. North England. Yeah, the roof traditionally would be more like this one here, some kind of York, Yorkshire stone. Another example just over there, this building here. 
you can see the the roof there. So that will be the more traditional roofing material, I guess. So on the way back up from the river, I should really have a stop, a quick tour around these gardens. Very tranquil. I couldn't film much of the uh, Breba Gardens, there's too many people about. Apparently this tunnel goes up to the, emerges up in the castle somewhere. It was dug as an escape thing or something. I can see a handrail. I'm not sure whether they open it up to the public or not, but anyway, a bit of interest. train coming back to York. Please make sure you take all belongings with you when you leave the train and keep them with you on inside at all times and on the stairs. If you do see anything suspicious, please mention it to any member of the staff.